I'm Anil Kumar and in this video we will try to understand Rolle's theorem. The question is verify that the function satisfies the three hypotheses of Rolle's theorem then find all numbers c that satisfies the conclusion of Rolle's theorem. The function here is f of x equals to x cubed minus x and the closed interval given to us is minus 1 to 1. Now the three points are, the very first one is that the function should be continuous. So we are looking for fx to be continuous. Now since we know it is a polynomial, of degree 3 in this case. Since it is a polynomial, we know all polynomials, whether it is degree 3 or whatever, all polynomials are continuous in their domain, right? So polynomial of degree 3, it is continuous in its entire domain, right? Therefore, it is also continuous in closed interval minus 1 to 1, right? So that is the first thing. Second thing we need to prove that f of x, the given polynomial, is differentiable. In open interval minus 1 to 1. So, so we are given f of x as equals to x cube minus x. Derivative of this function is 2x square minus 1. So as you can see, it is differentiable in the entire domain. So it is also differentiable in, in the restricted domain minus 1 to 1. As such, we know polynomials are smooth curves. So these are uh, smooth curves. So we can write here smooth curves differentiable in its domain. And therefore, it is also differentiable in restricted domain, right? So that is another thing. The third thing which we need to figure out is the value of the function at these two points, the extreme points. So let's find what is f of minus 1 equals to. So if I substitute minus 1 here, I get minus 1 cube minus of minus 1. And that gives me minus 1 plus 1, which is 0. Similarly, what is f of 1 equals to? So if I substitute 1 here, I get 1 cube minus 1. And that is also equal to 0. So what we see here is that f of minus 1 equals to f of 1 and both are equal to 0. So that is the third condition, right? So when we have f a equals to f b, in that case, we can apply the Rolle's theorem, right? Now the second part of this question is, then find all possible c that satisfies the conclusion of this theorem, right? So what is the conclusion? When we have all these three conditions met, in that case, we say that there is a point C so that F dash C is equal to zero. So that is the conclusion, right? So we need to find what that C is, right? So to find C, we know the derivative. We know F dash X in our case is equal to 3x square minus 1. We can equate this to 0 to find those points, right? So solving this, we get 3x square equals to 1, or x square equals to 1 over 3, or x is equals to square root of 1 over 3. And whenever you do square root, you know, we have positive and negative values, right? So these are the two values at which the derivative of this function is 0, right? So, so the c values are, so we have our answer here, and that is to say that f dash plus 
square root of 1 over 3 is equals to f dash at minus square root of 1 over 3 which should be 0 is that okay so c is plus minus square root of 3 so let me also sketch this function here and show you what we're trying to prove here right so i'll make a small sketch here just to demonstrate uh, to sketch it we can factor this equation so what we get here is if i take x common if i take x common in that case what do we get we get x x square minus 1 which could be factored further and written as x plus 1 times x minus 1 right so we have uh, three zeros one is at 0 the other one is at minus 1 and then one we have at plus 1 positive leading coefficient and so right side is up so the graph will be kind of like this okay and these two points which we found just now are really these horizontal asymptotes which are at minus 1 over square root 3 and plus 1 over square root 3 right so that is how we can show the solution graphically also right so i hope that helps you to understand what Rolle's theorem is and how we can apply it we'll take few more examples and then move on to mean value theorem i'm anil kumar you can always share and subscribe my videos thank you and all the best